video game tournament didn't happen over a violent video game. Instead, gamers were playing the Madden football game. It's an esports game like what we just told you about. Tonight, a local psychologist tells Four Near Corners Jasmine Miner when parents shield their children from disappointment throughout their lives, it can lead to angry outbursts down the road over things as simple as a video game. Right, Jasmine? Yeah, Jasmine, or uh, Lisa, this has been just a terrible event. And as we learn more about the shooting in Jacksonville, I spent some time talking to a local psychologist to help break down why in the U.S. we have had over 200 mass shootings just in this past year alone. And this doctor says she's seeing some troubling trends from younger generations. Excuse me, not an easy Another mass shooting. This time at a video game tournament in Jacksonville, Florida. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office says 24-year-old David Katz of Baltimore is the gunman. Investigators haven't released a motive. They don't seem to have the tools necessary to accept either negative news or negative experiences and process them. Lauren Mason, a local child psychologist at MindSpa in Naples, says she's seeing a trend with younger generations not being able to control their anger. The youngsters, when they are confronted with disappointment, they just automatically act out. She says it's because of what she calls helicopter parenting. When parents shield their kids too much, almost taking it too easy on their kids. Let them figure out how to problem solve on their own. And then after they've struggled a while, make some suggestions. According to the National Gun Violence Archive, the Jacksonville shooting marks the 234th mass shooting this year. And Dr. Mason says the idea of immediate gratification is only making the problem worse. Things the push of a button, whether we're talking about a video game or we're talking about social media, everything's immediate. They don't have to really wait for anything. Mason tells me the key is to allow children to learn how to fail in order to cope with negative experiences when they get older. And according to the National Gun and Violence Archive, this will be Florida's, just in the state of Florida, 22nd mass shooting this year. Live in the studio, Jasmine Miner, Box 4, in your corner. All right, thank you so much.